got myself the newer version of this if any of you guys have seen this checks how many amps watts you're using your high low of how much it used if you're checking like an air conditioner for its peak uh, I ha I've had this for a long time maybe six years of course I don't have to use it every day but it's nice to have two to go show people how much energy they're wasting when they leave their TV plugged in or stuff like that um, but now I see there's a model where it's backlit well, like heck yeah and maybe you can see it from an angle because sometimes you got to have this right on and yeah and we'll compare and see if they sync up I'm gonna use a standard light bulb which I don't even think this uses enough for it to even register but we'll see here's how Amazon actually Amazon shipped it to me like this very confusingly in a huge huge actually do I have it compared to this box they shipped it in this huge and the tracking number was wrong, so I opened it, and then this was in there. I was like, well, this isn't supposed to be in here. It was inside of a box that they could have just used anyways. Um, it was nice. Keeps the rain off of it if it rained. But it sounds super loose. I guess I bought it used, and I didn't even know. Instructions. Using the power meter, if you guys want to read this, uh, pause it, screenshot it, and look at your screenshots. Hopefully I held it there for you long enough. I'll go over that later. It's pretty simple. Definitely looks backlit. Here's the original. Um, you can definitely see there's a different screen going on there. I think it's mostly dirty because it bounced around in a box. The back of it almost is the same. Um, just seeing 1800 watts on the new one. All the specs are still the same. Looking good. So let's go ahead and test it out push all the buttons see what it's about but first I'm going to plug in my original one that I've had for quite some time zero watts I don't think it's really going to check amps too well on here because it's just a light bulb but we'll see it anyways four watts and it is steady on that four watts let's go see I haven't used any kilowatts volts 121 which is good amps 0 0.045 so it's pretty cool that it uh registers such a low number my low watts says low at the bottom there uh 2.2 watts my high was 4.1 i think it came back to a four how much it's cost me the time it's ran and we're back to four watts so that's uh that's my old one let's see uh how it compares to the new one actually let's do this first let's see how much the new one is using oh that's nice that's that's really nice so you guys can't really see in between there it says it's using zero I'm looking at this one while this one's plugged into it, it says it's using zero it's really hard to see that down in there oh no it wasn't it's using yeah I gotta do this off camera just a little bit it's using exactly one watt really hard to see in there one watt now if that comes up as a five watt when we plug the light into it okay looks like everything's gonna be about the same so let's go ahead and plug in the light should register four watts and it does just like the other one I can definitely see it from an angle now I don't know if you guys can see it. The old one was definitely hard to see from an angle. This light's kind of messing with it, but yeah, I could I could see it. Uh, let's go. How many kilowatts I've used? 120 volts. Uh, it's point hundredth of an amp lower. My lower watts. It actually registered lower watts. Um, my high watts is a a thousand <laughs> uh, whoa, what was that last one it didn't let me see it overload so it's got some new stuff it's got overload 3600 I guess that's when it shuts down I'm gonna totally unplug it off camera I guess that's all it's in there oh what's that is that the reset oh my gosh that's to reset it we're going to turn it on and reset it. 
because it had some weird stuff in there. Deep. Reset. I don't really need a tool to reset it, but that's cool. So now let's go through everything. Everything should be reset. That's checking how much volts is coming out of the wall. So that needs to be there. No amps, no low, no high. And overload kind of flips for some reason. Overload. I don't quite get the overload. Plug this in. Should go to 4 watts. Just like it did before. No kilowatts. We're at a little under... There, it's right where the other one was on the amps. My low was 3.1. High is 4. Overload. And we're back to there. What did the other one say? I think it said how much I used. I don't really use it, but... I kind of just use it for the watts and the amps. Yeah, on the other one, it was how much you used. So yeah, I like this one a lot better. You can see it from an angle, which is the most important thing I needed. And thanks for watching.